I'm not spreading hate, I'm spreading love. I'm spreading truth. My battery died in my GoPro. Jesus says you cannot love sin and love him at the same time. You must choose. I choose sin, baby. I choose sin. The punishment of sin is death. I always record. For my safety, for your safety, for truth. What's that? I send it. All right, it's on YouTube. It's going to be YouTube. Yep. What's that? Warrior Street Preacher. But if you have anxiety in your life, if you have depression in your life, that's caused by sin. For Jesus didn't give us the spirit of fear, but of a sound mind. If you want to get rid of that depression, if you want to get rid of that empty feeling that you have, then ask Jesus to come into your life. Ask him to come into your life. Repent of your sins. Turn from your sins and seek the truth. And be saved and have peace, true peace. That's what Jesus can offer you. That's why I'm here to tell you the truth. Jesus loves you so much that he died for you. The Bible says there's no greater love than to lay your life down for somebody else. And Jesus laid his life down for all of you. That's how much he loves you. But we have free will. I have forgiveness. That's what I have. I have repentance. I have repentance and forgiveness. No. Yes, we all sin. I'm not better than you, but, but I've repented of my sin. That's what Jesus says. He says you must turn from your sin, just like the adulteress. They were going to stone the adulteress, and, and Jesus gave her a favor, and he said, go and sin no more. He didn't say she could continue in adultery. But Jesus says, we all have sinned and fall short of the glory of God, the glory of heaven. All of us are sinners, even me. But I don't love sin. I don't choose to live in sin every single day. And that's the problem. Do you love sin or do you love your creator, the one that created you? And the punishment of sin is death. So sin will lead to death. You either love sin or you love life. What do you love more, your life or sin? More than your life. You love sin more than your life. Wow. Well, I have spoken the truth to you all. It's up to you. To choose. You have been you have been spoken the truth, so now you're without excuse on judgment day. You can't say God I didn't know the truth. Because God sent me here to preach to you all. So you all know the truth and you all have heard the truth. So you're without excuse on judgment day. So I dust my feet. And I ask that God blesses you all. I pray that God gives you all truth. I pray that He waters the seeds that have been planted. And I pray, I pray that you all get saved. I pray that you all turn from your sins one day before it's too late. In Yeshua's name I pray this. Amen.